Hey everybody, it's Stu, Alpha Golf 6 Alpha Golf, and I've been asked to do a quick video on how to get FL Digi set up to do a contest. There's an RTTY contest this weekend, and I plan to be a part of it. Uh, although I don't use the FL Digi interface natively when I'm doing RTTY for a contest, uh, I'm still using it through N1MM. But that's for another video. This video we're going to center on how to set up FL Digi for the Riddy contest. Anyway, hope you enjoy it. Hi everybody, it's Stu. I'm going to go ahead and try to set FL Digi up for uh, contesting today. Uh, the Riddy contest is tomorrow and I want to get myself all set up for that because I want to participate in it. So, I'm going to pop up here. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go to configure. Now, real important, I need to make sure that my sound card is set up for my radio. That's the right stuff. And while I'm in here, I'll click over here on rig. And I want to make sure that uh, my rig's configured properly and it's all set to go. So it looks like it is. All right. And then I'm going to go over here to uh, the UI. And I want to go to contest. And I've already selected this, but for your benefit, when you go in here, it's going to say no contest. So I'm going to go ahead and I am going to select the, for this contest, the North American QSO, uh, QSO party. Um, and I don't have a state, right? It's not a state QSO party. It's all of North America. So that's going to be cool. I want to turn duplicate checking on and I'm going to leave it set to band. Here's the exchange that I am going to send. Stu, right? That's my name. And then California, Charles Alpha. So there you go. Uh, this is all set to go. Um, I'll just click save here. We'll glance over here to log. And this is some other stuff, right? Prompt, all that stuff. This should be standard for the logging that you do all the time. Um, then again, you know. Uh, if you've got something special in here, you know, you may want to change it. Uh, for example, I'm going to set my transmit power to 100 because I'm going to be running the maximum power allowed in this contest, which is 100 watts. All right, let's go ahead and save that. We'll select close. Okay, now I've got that all set up. Now let's go ahead and edit our macros. So got macros down here. I've got all sorts of sets. There's a number here, three, four. Here's one. That's a standard CQ. Uh, this one is C answer, C report. I believe that's for CW. Um, and let's go ahead and click here. And here I have the third one set up kind of for contest. So I'm going to right hand mouse click this and I'm going to pull up my editor. And right now I right mouse clicked the CQ and that's going to be CQ4, and this is so we know what it is when we look at it. We're in the North American QSO party, NAQP. And my CQ is simply CQ, NAQP, uh, N -A -Q -P, uh, D, E, and my call sign, and then I go back to receive to listen. Okay, so this is me calling CQ. That looks good. I'll go ahead and hit apply. And close. How about send exchange? I'll right hand mouse click that. So now I have all the exchange in here. There's a lot of stuff in here though that I don't need. Like I'm only going to send the call one time and then I'm going to change this a bit and I can just actually go down here. I believe I can scroll down. What I'm looking for is uh, IN. X. Let's see. I believe that's what it is. Uh, let's see. There was a day when I could just pull this stuff out of the air, but I, I just can't do it anymore. I actually have to look at this stuff. Uh, let's see. Include XN. Exchange in and X out. Exchange out. So I want to put this over here. There we go. Call. Exchange out. And then my call. And that does that. 
And we'll go ahead and apply that. And we'll close. All right. And here is if I'm responding with an exchange. And that's going to be basically QSL. Um, let's see. Person's call sign. My call sign. That's just saying, yes, I received your exchange. 73. All right. That looks good. We'll apply that and close it. And let's see. Let's go ahead and we will take a look at... Uh, QSO. So, yeah, we're not really doing any QSOs, so I don't really need this here. Let's see. What are some of my other choices? Back to you, QRZ. Um, there we go. QRZ is a good one. We can go ahead and look at QRZ, and that's going to be DE my call, QRZ. Okay, that's a good one to have. Let's see. What else do I have? Well, this QSO, interestingly enough, I can actually change this. We're going to say reply. As if we're replying to a QSO, and we would do that by just sending our call. And then, of course, we want to go back into RX mode or receive mode. The micros are really, really simple to set up on this. Doing these is simple, and these uh, macros that uh, are available for it to run are great. Um, but uh, like anything else, it's uh, a bit of a challenge sometimes to get this set up. And that's really a brief overview. I mean, that's about it. Uh, and again, like the important thing here is when I go over here to the contest setup, make sure I have the right contest, make sure my exchange is right, and I'm set to go. Anyway, all right. Well, thanks all for listening. Well, I hope you found that useful. I know it was kind of a quick uh, go over on it, but um, hopefully it's going to help you with your first digital contest. Anyway, thanks for tuning in and Hope to hear you out there on the ether. This is Alpha Golf 6 Alpha Golf 73.